billion tons of trash are dumped into landfills every year around the globe. That's so much trash that if you lined it up in garbage trucks, it could circle the earth 24 times. Wow, but Sweden has found a way to make their trash work for them. By using it to fuel a waste to energy program that converts garbage into sustainable energy. Sweden has even gotten so efficient at this process that they've run out of their own trash and now import garbage from other places. Believe it or not, only 1% of Swedish garbage actually ends up in a landfill. So where does it all go? About half, or 47%, of Sweden's waste is recycled. The program recycles and sorts metals, plastics, newspapers, batteries, and electronics. The remaining 52% of the country's waste, like excluded scrap metal, circuit boards, and agricultural waste, is used for the country's Waste to Energy, or WTE, program, which produces electricity from burning waste. So all that remains is a remarkable 1% of Sweden's trash that actually ends up in a landfill. But wait, how exactly does garbage turn into energy? After recyclable content has been removed, the remaining trash is brought to a waste to energy plant. There, the trash gets loaded into furnaces and burned, which generates a large amount of steam that spins generator turbines, producing electricity for the nation's power grid. All leftover metals are separated and recycled, while any other remaining materials that do not burn, like porcelain and tile, are collected and repurposed into gravel for road construction. Over the past decade, Sweden has become so good at this waste-to-energy process that they've actually run out of their own garbage and had to start importing it from other countries. It's a win-win situation for most countries, since shipping trash to Sweden is not only cheaper than paying landfill taxes, but it also makes sure more garbage is reused. In 2014 alone, countries like the UK and Italy exported about 2.3 million tons of waste to Sweden's WTE facilities. Those factories charge about $43 per ton of trash, meaning that for those 2.3 million tons, the country made almost $100 million in revenues. Day by day, Sweden gets closer to becoming a zero-waste nation with efforts both large and small. Their Waste to Energy program has even inspired other countries to consider it for themselves. Do you think a Waste to Energy program would be beneficial in your country? Nameless.